what you've heard. So I guess. No, what I know. Well, I don't know what you're referring to, but. That, okay, that's what, what I'm referring to is you telling Zay that she's either too fat or she, she eats too much or she's not your type or you fucking hitting on other people at different bars. That's what I'm. Hey guys, welcome to the Gita. I'm Josh. I'm Billy. And I'm Ashley. And today we're talking Love is Blind, After the Altar, Season 3. That's right, we're back from about a month-long hiatus, man. I tell you what, it's good to be back to talk some Love is Blind, right? You know, it's been a while, so we got to talk about this show, and uh, but we finally got a little more... Uh... A little more uh, finality on it here. Yeah, love some love is blind. Yeah. Where are they now? That's right. Exactly. And this is kind of weird because this has been filmed, but it seems like there's even a lot longer time even after this, and that's kind of been yeah. the issue with this season, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, they, there's too many leaks on social media, I yeah. think. and Yeah, the yeah, stuff you, you about Raven was ago. leaked about a Raven, long yeah. time ago. Yeah, right. so I'm like... I don't know that this added any value to me. Nah. Like, well, and, and the thing too is what I've re- what I've really started realizing for these reunion episodes, they're 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 bringing their friends along, talking to their friends, but they're talking to the friends like it's the first time they've talked to them about this whole situation. It's like, dude, you know, you've talked, you know, so it's it's almost just fake at that point, right? So, I, I, and, and you got that vibe in this one for sure. Well, it's because so. they they got to tell us, right? Yeah, exactly. I'm wondering why they just waited so long to get this out there. Yeah, it's weird. Well, it's been a year. <laughs> it's been a year it. from when, it's been a year, year from this, but like it's obviously been even longer than that in reality. Them, right, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. So hey, I don't know. Whatever, man. We finally got it. Right? <laughs> we got it. <laughs> we finally got and it. this is the one where they're following them around. They're not sitting with Nick Lachey and hashing things out or anything like that. Thank N- God. There wasn't a Nick Lachey at all. No, no. Except for like the ad at the end. But yeah, exactly. Talking about yeah. the new show. Yeah. So maybe there'll be a follow up to the follow up. As we we've, we've seen in the past as well. Yeah, hopefully, maybe get one more little taste of. I don't know. I think I, I'm kind of over this. <laughs> <laughs> we need well, shake why, back. Why, that's because you follow my social media. You already know what's I going on. I don't follow them we on social media. Drama. I just follow the drama the that drama gets, of it, like, right. it gets talked about on social media when it's like a spark of it or whatever. But yeah. So what do you think about seeing the cast again? Alexis talking about. Wanting a C-section. She don't want a normal yeah, birth. That's right. At least she says she don't want that vajayjay getting screwed that's up. That's right. You know? <laughs> I say there's a lot of OBGYNs out there saying that's just not how that works. And that's exactly what her stepmother told her, right? She's like, yeah, it didn't work that way. You, you get back to normal. Well, and it's also, you don't just get to choose to have a C-section for vanity reasons or whatever. You're actually, like, there's whole big studies on trying to push people away from getting C-sections. So. I, think, I think some people get to choose. Yeah, I right? think so I as think well. I think in some I places some you could probably get, get it done. Yeah. yeah, well, though some people aren't people like <laughs> us or even the Alexa. Yeah. <laughs> so, Alexa and Brennan, what do you guys think about Brennan's this, still this a couple? bitch. <laughs> They're married. Wow. One of the two couples yeah. that got married. And his father-in-law calls him out. When your father-in-law's calling you a bitch saying, hey, uh, I think you need to take control of my daughter because she's definitely wearing the pants in the family, you got problems. I think she has the upper hand. I would level that out a little bit. You think? Fact. 100%. <laughs> oh my. They look happy, though. Yeah, I mean, that's true. If it's yeah. working for him, yeah. mm-hmm. uh, yeah, she's happy with it, obviously. <laughs> if it was me, I'd flip that shit around, but that's a hard thing to do. We have a healthy balance in our relationship, thank you. He (laughs) takes control sometimes, and then sometimes I do, which is necessary. Of course, she's in a good situation. He seems to be okay with it, so I thought, I found it odd, I don't know, not odd, but interesting that his whole family converted to Judaism, allegedly. Yeah. I see, but I, I don't know was if he was sarcasm? actually serious. Yeah, I, think I, I don't know if he was joking yeah, or not, but joking. they all had the hats and every, it seemed yeah, like it was yeah. thing. Yeah. So I was like, I don't know. Yeah, I think, I think maybe they were just wearing it just because supported they were in the environment or, supported, yeah. but I think he was kind of joking. I don't think Brennan was that, wearing one, though. So. Was he? Yeah, I don't think so. Yeah, yeah, maybe I'm wrong. But, I mean, it's kind of interesting. Yeah. I mean, definitely were. I mean, dude, her dad's great. I forget. I love that guy. He's the star of this family. (laughs) And we flat out telling him, you know, if I was you, I'd be flipping the script on that shit. (laughs) I was like, dude, you're telling your son in law to take control of your daughter, man. I was like, holy God. Brennan's looking at him with this, like, look on his face, like, stop talking because I'm going to get in trouble for this later. Like, (laughs) Uh (laughs) yeah. That that was awesome. Mm -hmm. He's he's wondering if he's going to like replace Harrison Ford next in Ann Jones movie because he's whipped. (laughs) That's right, exactly. 
Well, but, they, but yeah, I mean, they seem like they work together. Though. I mean, yeah, I mean, they out of all the couples, they're definitely the most stable. No doubt about it. Well, maybe you should take that as a note, guys. That women should be in control. <laughs> Sure. Sure it, works. <laughs> it works. It works. Works for him. Well, she probably brings all the money to the Right, that's true. She owns her own so. business and he's... Is that who wears the pants, who brings the money? It probably has a lot is of it? say, I would think. Mm, yeah. Okay. Yeah, I'm sure it does have some. Good to know. Good to know. <laughs> <laughs> Good to know. <laughs> now, Matt and Colleen still are not living together oh, okay. after a year of marriage. Marriage is a train wreck, man. Holy and cow, And everyone's dude. questioning you. Yeah. Oh, yeah. For, that, for a good reason. <laughs> well, good I reason love that they weren't. Everybody was very supportive, kind of on like the whole the reunion show where they're sitting on the couch talking and stuff mm-hmm. like that. And now that they're like having these private conversations out at the bar or having dinner or lunch or whatever, it's like, but you don't live together. Y'all don't want to live together. It's not. Oh no, hold on. You, no, y'all not, know that it's not, that it's not something I would do. It's Absolutely. not. It's but, not that we don't want to live together. I don't want to get that narrative out there. It's not that we don't want to live together. Well, you're not. Yeah, well, you know that's weird, right? And that, well, that, and that's all Brennan, right? The other two dudes are like, hey, you know, it's okay. We get your situation. Brennan's like, nah. Brennan's yeah, Brennan, Brennan yeah, Brennan's has great. all these faces like. Yeah, exactly. And he's like, <laughs> and he's like, he's like shut up there, you know, pussy whip boy. You know, and he's not. Talking, like, you know, telling Brennan's him how to not, live his life when you're freaking, you know, can't even keep your wife. Brennan is not buying. No, he's not like, buying anything. Anything he's sa- selling. He's like, yeah. you know, everybody else is just like, oh, okay, so that works for you. Okay, that's great. And, and I'm not the Brennan, biggest fan Brennan. of Brennan, but I think he's right here. <laughs> so, <laughs> to so. an extent, but at the same time, it's like, dude, keep that to yourself. You know what I mean? Like, you don't you don't be at so super judgy as you're being right there. Yeah, he is being very you know? judgy. Yeah, he's, I mean, he's super yeah. judgy. And, he, and he's not even like trying to be nice about it. You know, he's like, see, he's making all those faces. He's an asshole about it. Mm-hmm. You know, so it's like, dude, you ain't gonna be that his way. His asshole side does come out during he, some it of does. these. Yeah. I, I, I know. <laughs> but yeah, I think if you're married and, and if you're that in love with each other, how could you stand to be separated like that? Yeah, well, Especially that, you're already married. It's, well, it yeah. just doesn't make a lot of sense to me. Here's the other thing that doesn't make sense. It's been a year. The big reason why they weren't going to do it is because it was going to cost them $5,000 to right. break the lease. Right. Do, you, do you have a more than a year lease? Like, aren't don't you lease? Right, it's over, year? right? Time's up. Like, at some point in time within yeah. this last year, 12 months, your lease had to have been renewed or right. up. So, like, well, well, well what they did what say, too, here? they did say, look, you know, we know that if we didn't get married, we wouldn't be together right now. Like, the only reason we are together right now still is because we got yeah, married. I imagine that's a true statement. Yeah, you know, and they're like, we got married, so we realized, hey, we're at least willing to fight for each other. So that's why we're still together. Well, and then there's the whole wiener dog situation. Yeah, right, right. Yeah, the humping everything. <laughs> the <around>. humper dog. <laughs> but, yeah, you she, know, don't, she don't like that. What the thing that killed me, too, is like the women were making such a big deal about him when she was talking with them, like, oh, you're choosing the dog of your wife. And he's like, that's not what he's doing. Yeah, he's, he's not you know, doing like, that. Get out of here, yeah. you know? So I, mean, I didn't like that aspect either. Yeah. Or, you know. I mean, oh, she should also not. Those girls are very catty about some oh, things. Yeah. They really yeah. are. She should also not have to put him in a position to choose her over right. the dog. Yeah, so, like, like no one dog. points he, that out. Yeah, but he but... had the dog. You knew he had the dog when you married him, right? So, I mean, it's like... Uh, uh, did she know he was a humper, though? Well, maybe not, but still. He yeah. had the dog. What's it like having a husband? I got really close, but I didn't really get one, so I'd love to know. You dodged a fucking bullet with that. Okay. Yes, she did. Okay. Big... Yeah, and there's a lot of, like, coal bashing when oh, people yeah, are together and stuff me. like that. No, no that one stands me. up for this guy. No. And I'm like, this is... No. This kind of makes me wonder, like, what everybody else has seen and, like, what the conversations... At, at this point in time, they've heard everybody talk about this when mm-hmm. they're filming this. So, like, no, none of you have, like... For example, like, Brennan, he's taking everything Alexa tells him. Oh, yeah. He's taking his heart and just Yeah, that really Cole. bothers me a lot, yeah. where he's like, I know this is going on. It's like, yeah. you don't know crap. Shit, yeah, yeah, that's what Cole said to him. And, and finally, Cole's like, all right, do whatever. You know, Cole just kind of tried to squash it. I was it, you proud know? of Cole in that yeah. moment, because he but, wasn't going to, there was, he wasn't going anywhere in that conversation. Oh, and, and he knew it, right? He knew there was nothing he was yeah. going to, you know. Yeah, exactly. Uh, and, and I mean, Brennan was hot. He was coming in hot. Right, yeah. <laughs> he, he was yeah. mad. Like, yeah. this guy is mad as if, like, like Cole has said these things to him. Yeah, yeah like, I know. Yeah. Like Cole was nothing but nice to that guy the whole time on the yeah. show, right? Cole got along with everybody, you know. But yeah, this dude's just getting off on him, you know, because of what his wife told him. So like, dude, get Cole out of here, co- man. Or he's Brennan going coming off, in with not Brennan. Off. <laughs> <laughs> That's a different thing. Yeah, he's going out on it's him. A different show. <laughs> Brennan coming in with a bunch of bullshit. I'm sure Cole was. I'm sure Cole appreciated that he wasn't getting off on him. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I, I don't get like why. He cares so much about. I, I, yeah, no, I don't either. Right? Like, why, like, like, why are you so in concerned about Cole and his relationship? Right? Just mind your own business and worry about your relationship. 
Yeah. And and I don't really get like why they're inviting him to this party when they don't even seem to like the guy. Nobody. Yeah. Not yeah. one of them is like trying to throw this guy out. Well, Bartise is trying to like yeah, that's true. work but it out. But he's also the other black sheep of the group. Oh, yeah. you know what it's I mean? like, right. He didn't take more right. arrows. And if whatever. anybody <laughs> is truly the guy that's that like that, it's Bartise, right? Yeah. So, it's like, come on, man. And um, maybe SK. Right, why not? At this point, it's for sure SK at this point, right? filming, SK is an angel. Yeah. Yeah. I was surprised to see them, like, follow this angle after we know all this stuff. And meeting him at the airport, all this stuff. And you're like, what are you you trying to sell me? I'll tell you you what's funny too with his brother, dude. His brother was like, like he was marrying her. He's like, oh, yeah, bro, we got to get this fixed. We got to make this work. And she's like, well, you marrying her too? Like, what's going on here? Maybe she'll marry the brother. (laughs) Yeah, maybe. (laughs) And they did seem like they had a pretty good thing going on. Oh, yeah. I wish I wish I knew more about this story, actually. Well, you can tell <laughs> you can tell by the what she filmed after and different things that I have seen her post on, on social media. She was all in on him. Oh, yeah. Like oh, and she absolutely did, she trusted him. She like bared her soul to him. Like mm-hmm. this is she's like, okay, this is my person that I'm going to be. Is it? vulnerable with yeah. and then he does that and it's and Twice. it's not just yeah. and it's not like he just and that they <laughs> didn't play that out either like how it all went down it wasn't just like he was out and he like made a connection this man's yeah it's like to know how to have it relationships with right. that like he the way he discussed and, and talked about what was going on with Raven and how he was on that show to these other women was like, oh, it's just like a, a contract. You sure you're I'm not doing on. a Brennan thing and just taking someone else's word for it? Right. Right. Well, there's right. screenshots and texts oh. and stuff. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, that's crazy, man. You know, when it's crazy, I mean, because like out of all the people on that show, man, she was like the most kind hearted, just freaking overall good person. I thought like she was an awesome person. She was really into him. She treated him very well. She had like the you biggest know, turnaround. And she's so. a beautiful girl. She you know? did. Yeah, and oh, she, yeah. When yeah. she talked to him, she wasn't work. She didn't work out. Like she actually yeah. listened to him when he talked yeah, exactly. instead of like well, doing but, jumping jacks. Oh yeah. Well, then you had Zeneb, who was still like holding true, like everything yeah. I said. I believe yeah, is all true. And that irritated like, dude, me too. Get out of here, with your crap, like, man. You got nothing yeah. to take back or reflect on or anything. Yeah, she's exactly. grown a lot. Yeah, she's yeah, you grown tell. a lot. And she's ready for a new relationship. Like hell no, you're not. <laughs> I think you need to see that counselor a little bit longer there, sweetheart, she's, before you can actually learn to own some of your own problems and your mistakes. She's grown and she's healed from, yeah. from the hurt. You know? Yeah, you can totally so. tell. I mean, it was good to get the cold try to hash it out with her, and I guess no, that somewhat worked yeah. to a certain extent. So, Yeah, and I, I, I don't know. I mean, she was I going like along with it for a little bit. But. I did like that the way, the way he apologized, and it's kind of like a, a sleight of hand kind of apology where he mm. said, I'm sorry. That things I said and did hurt you. like, And I didn't realize I was hurting you. And I didn't yeah. realize I was hurting you because he didn't apologize for what he... Because he didn't really do anything wrong. She right. just took everything exactly. he said the wrong way. And he just... He really genuinely feels bad she did that, I think. Oh, yeah. yeah. Or that that's how it played out. Yeah, that's how right, she exactly. perceived it, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, I thought uh, Bartice was pulling Cole aside for a second because the way he was talking to so Alexa's to the mom. Because I was like, yeah. what is this fool doing? What is this fool doing? You're not a mom. You're not a mom. <laughs> you're, like, you're like my age. <laughs> he's like, can we like, date? Right, right. <laughs> I was like, this dude is clueless right here, right. How, how he's coming off to her. You know what I mean? He's yeah. like, all right, that's oh. enough. That's enough. But, <laughs> I thought Bartie's like, hey, man, you can't be talking to people like right, that. Dude, what are you doing? Like, no, 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 Cole, come on, bro. Let me, let me have a word with you. But you're like really beautiful. And I just thought Alexa's mom would be the same age as my mom because I'm the same age as Alexa. You're way younger than my mom. Cole, I need you to come with me right now. Sorry. Oh, you, you remember that whole perception thing? <laughs> you're doing it again. Right. <laughs> so, speaking of Bartie's, what did you think of? Yeah, Nancy. Nancy obviously yeah. had some hangups with Barty. Well, she still had feelings for him big time, yeah. right? So, I mean... And she tried to say it wasn't, but it seemed pretty oh, yeah. obvious well, that it was. Well, and the funny thing about it is, like, her family's absolutely right. If you're not going to gain anything from this friendship, then what's the point of being friends? I hey, but do it, not like that. I, do I like was that. okay with it. I do, because <laughs> if you've got somebody you're friends with, but... You're not getting anything from them. And I don't even mean like they're giving you shit. I mean, even like emotional support, you know, or, you know, somebody you can count on. Then what's the point of the friendship? There's too right? much baggage. So, and, and, and exactly. And there's way too much baggage between them to even try to make that work. So here's so, the I mean, issues I, I had that. with all that is 
everyone was telling Nancy what to do. And Nancy was telling everybody, I've got to do this for myself. Mm -hmm. I've, you know, I don't just cut people off. That's not who I am. That's who you are, mom. I respect that's who you are. You're a beast. You're mean. I don't know. She bad said, bitch. Yeah, she's bad bitch. Yeah, that's what it was. That's yeah, what it was. Because yeah, her mom's like, he fucked up. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. She'll cut someone for sure. <laughs> but, and then even at, when at the girls brunch thing, you know, everybody's telling her, you know, mm-hmm. cut him off, blah, blah, blah. And yeah, she's telling the cameras and she's telling everybody that she just wants to be his friend. And we can kind of all see no, it underneath that she was, she's a, hoping for a little bit more. But she needs to work that out for you guys, for you guys. Yeah, for you guys for to sit here and way, tell man. her that she has to do this. And she's like, I'm trying. And she keeps asking for everybody to give her that space to work through it herself. Mm-hmm. So I feel like she was almost bullied into ending contact yeah, with him. Yeah, I think she was. But at the same time, I think she did realize that they're probably right. Like, this is just is going nowhere, you know. I, and Because she had the hangups. And, like, exactly. I don't think she was just looking for a friend. I think she was hoping to turn that something into something turn, else. That's exactly what she was hoping And for. she would have gotten strung along again, mm-hmm. the way Bartise was talking. Yeah, and exactly. Brennan did make a point, even though he said it in a really mean way, to Bartise. Have you told her right. that this is purely a friendship thing, that you there is no hope. Is she hanging on to that small shred of hope? Mm-hmm. And he's like, no, I think she knows. No, Have you well, said it to her? <laughs> and, and quite frankly, I think Bartiz is perfectly happy stringing her along because yeah. he, he was really happy like having a friends of benefits yeah. kind of thing if he could make that work with her, right? So He, he seemed yeah. like he had that attitude. Oh, yeah, exactly. Yeah. But, but I will give kudos to the other girls because like Bartiz is like, hey, the other girls came and told me that they told you that you should cut it off with me. And I was like, hey, well, kudos to them. At least they didn't. We're just talking behind his back. They actually went and told him the same thing they told her, right? So. And he was like, but I don't understand why you would do that. And I was like, mm, well, there's no value. Right, right. But you understand you why you just don't want to. Here. Right. You're a jerk. Well, then. You're not fun. Well, you can't it. have sex. Right, right, right. Why are we friends? Right. But I, I got to <laughs> When, when Alexis walked in that dress to that floor, me, I was like, "Holy cow!" The dress, dude. I the was dress. Like, was it a dress? <laughs> yeah, I don't think it was, man. It was like know. lingerie, or <laughs> I don't even know. Right. Let's say we took a black sheet and just cut a shit ton of holes on it. Yeah. And just put it on. It weird. I couldn't I believe like, she was wearing. That. Oh, that was crazy, man. Yeah. I, I like, oh. um, I gotta say, I was looking at her boobs the whole time. I'm trying to figure out like, how can you not see the boobs? Because clearly, you see like you the, see the nipple, underwear, right. like could see a lot of butt. I know. Yeah, that. yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you could see the <laughs> underwear part underneath because it's a see-through dress. But I'm like, is it see-through or is it sheer? Like, because yeah. there was no like underwear top to it, like bralette to it right. or anything. So there I was, was like, no, how you are see you any, not like, seeing her breasts like that? Right. So yeah. maybe maybe there's I don't know some there skin was, color thing. Yeah, probably, right. Yeah, I was just trying to figure it out. <laughs> But yeah, that thing. I was like, "Holy crap!" You know, it's funny because I'm like, you know, when they're walking out of the house, they make sure they don't show her. And I'm like, I okay, "What's the secret?" I of this? was waiting for it. every you know, time yeah. a car door opened right. and someone said, "I was like, is this the dress? Is this it?" Yeah, what and then is she it? steps out. I'm like, "Holy cow!" Like, well, the God, theme, man. the theme was sexy. Remember? Yeah, yeah it was she sexy. wanted it sexy. <laughs> so. She wanted it. Yeah, no kidding. The theme was sexy. Oh, yeah, Anything that else that stood out to you yeah. guys? Colleen and um. What's his name? I know we talked Don't about the Melon. Yeah. What about the demeanor and everything at the party? She was Those really guys are kind of awkward yeah. and, and, and boring. And, you know? um, they are, but it's very, their whole interactions, it makes everybody around them uncomfortable. Yeah. Yeah. Kind of. Yeah. yeah. You know, and, and, and Colleen they're, they're, just always looks uncomfortable. Yeah. And they're just not, and there's times where she seems like, okay, laughing and like everything's cool. But yeah, like probably 70% of the time she does. She's uncomfortable when you're like, yeah, this ain't gonna work, man. Like, how, I, I, how, on what planet is that couple gonna stick together and everything gonna work out for them, man? Because I just, I don't see that happening. Well, maybe she's just always that awkward, so that's yeah, who maybe. she is. I don't know. She really was monitoring how much alcohol was being. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I, I but ho- hopefully, really don't know how bad it got the right. last time she, he was drunk. I, I think maybe that. Hopefully, at least that show kind of puts to bed, put to bed the whole battered woman crap that came out, the, you know, on the last yeah. time. So, yeah, yeah. I, you know, I that, wasn't that was a just, fan of that. Yeah, so. no. That did. I mean. You can tell she definitely has some sway and some say in what goes on in that relationship, right? And yeah. just him freaking controlling her. Yeah. So I think it's actually split pretty evenly. Oh yeah, I think two. so as well. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Even like the conversation they were, you know, when they went to went to lunch with uh, his mom and stepdad, and kind of the way they were talking with them about you know the relationship and everything, and you know, and they're even like, yeah, you know, he, Matt's a runner, you know, that's his problem, right? You know, which you know, you guys are still living apart, and anytime you guys argue, he just goes back to his house, and you know, like, how the hell do you expect to you know that's fix nice. anything? It's nice. Yeah. <laughs> They remind me of that couple on the ultimatum a little bit that always got into it. And then they were like one of the strongest couples, though, at the end. So, yeah. 
Well, remember, even Raven said they fight all the time. She's like, mm-hmm. yeah, Matt and Conan just fight all the time. So they, yeah, both of them. So. Yeah. so, I mean, maybe they just gel together because they're they're similar. I don't they're know. They're fighters. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I mean maybe fighting. you won't, they, they won't get into a relationship where they don't have any kind of drama. So, and they both, yeah. I don't know, yeah, are, so are comfortable like, with like it. They both kind of thrive on it a little bit, right? They like the drama, I think. I don't know. But overall, I mean, like like you said in the beginning, it was it was underwhelming, right? I mean, I think last yeah. season had a much more you know much more drama in the you know in the not in the as later much drama as like and... the shake thing, not as oh, much yeah, drama as the first one with what's her name? Was it Jessica? Yeah, I think yeah, her name was yeah, it was Jessica. Yeah. There you go, cool. the drunk, the drunk chick. Yeah. Was, mm-hmm. yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah, I mean, I don't like that Colleen toned down Matt. Nah, that's his name because I needed there was no drunk person. Yeah. You need the drunk drama. Although Brandon or Brandon did still. Uh, He'll show his ass some there with his freaking assholeness and just being a freaking. He, you know, yeah, he, he he's probably the worst person on the show for oh, yeah. me as far yeah, as likability. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I get he works for Alexa. He works <laughs> for Alexa. <laughs> probably literally. <laughs> <laughs> he probably does get W two at the end of the year. <laughs> what yeah. I just don't like his attitude. I don't oh, like no, the way dude. he approaches Cole with like little to no information, yeah. but he acts like it's it's like concrete. Mm-hmm. Like and I don't even get why he has the beef yeah. to even begin. He shouldn't have beef at all. It's such know? a strong beef too. Oh yeah, and well, he I mean, was like, there he was with heated, Cole man. in many of those instances, especially the bar yeah. scene. He's talking where there's no happen. evidence that and he was even, with the even woman. He was like, I don't remember seeing any women there. You know, it's yeah. just like, dude, like, it's like what the? <laughs> so, yeah, that was crazy. He's a, but man. Alexa said it happened. But he's so. ready to pick up that sword <laughs> oh, and yeah, like man. charge. Yeah, him. no kidding, dude. I was like, man, yeah. that dude's just nuts. Do you like? Uh, yeah, I don't like that dude. And then when he's like listing off all the things, I don't like how you, you always told her she was fat. And I'm like, he, he never, never said she was said fat. She was fat. Yeah. And then that's when he's like, dude, you're hearing from what your wife's telling you. No, my wife's got nothing to do with this. It's like, dude, yeah, your wife's got everything to do with this, man. So you I said, I'm trying to be a better person. Well, yeah, everyone yeah. wakes up. Yeah. They don't say. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't say I want to be a worse person today. Yeah. That is, I, that well, is a valid doing? point, though. There's a lot of people who say stuff like that, you right. know, and it's a valid yeah. point. He's like, yeah, no one wakes up saying they're going to be a worse person. And, that's also not true, I think, because I think some people do. Some people thrive on it. Right? Yeah. <laughs> Let's see how much more of an asshole I could be today than I was yesterday. Them, I think. <laughs> yeah. So what? What about Zineb though? I haven't discussed her. Too she much. still needs she to did, grow. Man. Yeah, she, she definitely needs she to grow. She thinks she's grown. She, she still she's holds grown. everything against him and acts like everything is his fault. And I'm like, nah, man, that's not the case at all. And there was no, sh- you know, they they didn't show us enough on that show to to prove anything that she said that he did. Right. So. Yeah, I think she definitely needs to grow. She definitely is not ready for another relationship yet. Yeah, just I mean, I stick with that counselor. She just seems vindictive, and yeah. I don't know, holds on to like oh, yeah. some hate or something. You know, yeah, she's got all the girls ganging up on Cole. I like, got them all buying into her bullshit. You know, and even that freaking one chick that looked like an elf that she took with her to the freaking party. You know? <laughs> <Jeez>. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Oh, man. Billy with the judgment over here. <laughs> All right. I'm turning into Brendan. <laughs> <laughs> At least she was wearing uh, clothes. I'm like, what's that? Yeah, right, right. And, and that's just disappointing because she started off as like one of my early favorites. So oh, yeah. to see her like go down that path is disappointing. Yeah, I just, I mean, again, she's a beautiful girl too. Like, yeah, she is gorgeous. I just want to again point out that I called her as a red flag. Like, no, you did. You did. Yeah, the, the first one to call it. So I agree. She's beautiful and she's not fat, but. She's a horrible Toxic. person. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I say she's a horrible person. She's just. She's got problems. She needs to deal with. She's I got insecurities even, that con- yeah. that control her every thought and and the way she views the world and people. I don't mm-hmm. even know what personality would mesh well with her, honestly. A yeah. uh, uh, Brennan probably who just says yes. Maybe. Yes. Maybe. Yeah. Just wanted Maybe. Whatever, right? Somebody just want to do whatever she says. Well, I don't yeah. know, because then Brennan would say something stupid, and she'd just take that and twist it. And, and I think he mentioned that. Um, cool was like how she always twists. Oh, yeah. He was like afraid to talk to her. Right. He's like, oh, yeah, he's, like, it's like, he's like, it's like I'm walking on eggshells and I'm talking to her. I'm surprised you know. like she didn't address like the cutie thing and stuff because she's yeah. so adamant about it. I wish there was footage Dude. and then boom, they show the footage and uh-huh. she still isn't like walking anything back. So it's Dude, like. I loved cutie. in the one on one though how Cole brought the cutie with him. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Cole's a funny guy. Yeah, he he's is. a fun, oh, yeah. funny guy. But yeah, he, he is immature at the same time. Oh, he oh, is. Yeah. No doubt about it. Yeah, no doubt about it. That dude's definitely immature. Even when he like threw that pillow, like Zineb was like, 
Like, what, what the hell are you doing? doing? Like, thanks for reminding me. Yeah, Another thanks for reminding me how you're, how you're a clown. Right, 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 exactly. <laughs> yeah, I mean, he's he's not ready for adulting, but, you know. No. Yeah, and she's kind of, like, super serious, and he's too jokey, so mm-hmm. I don't think it... And, 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 she, know, and she's and not really jokey kinda, at all, I right? So drew them two all. together. Yeah. Like, I think she was attracted to him initially because of that, but she couldn't handle it. Yeah, once well, yeah, you got a piece of it, she's like, okay, this is too much for me, right? Yeah. Well, and I guess... And hurt with the seriousness for him, right? He's like, damn, like, I'm walking on eggshells, I don't know what the hell say around this girl so yeah but cole has even come out and defended how we viewed everything because we don't see everything and he's like it wasn't always like that she is play she can be playful she can be you know fun because because they really didn't show anything like and even this at it like i'm like i see no fun side of you yeah well that's the thing like he just he pretty much just took the shit in this and and said fine i'll take it and own it whatever It's, it's on me you know so the whole time he's constantly being the guy you know, and at the end of the day, even though he acts mature, he's actually kind of more mature for actually just doing that, just trying to squash him. Like, fine, if I, if I got to be the bad guy here, then I'll be the bad guy, whatever. I just don't want any more beef, you know? I just want this shit yeah. done, you know? So. Yeah. But yeah, man. Well, what do you guys think about the, uh, the nice little trailer we got there, that new perfect match? It's kind of interesting. I, I'm I'm interested in seeing all these various people from different oh, yeah, shows man. combined on one, so. Yeah, we got Jake. I don't know about Damon. who they chose, though, like Bartice and, and yeah. people like I that. I call him Jake, because it was like Jay Busey, but his name is Shane. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, Shane. 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 They, so they're choosing some some wild ones. Yeah, oh, yeah. Maybe they'll make it for an interesting show. Because of Francesca. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yes, sir. And, the, I mean, they're going from all sorts of different shows. There's shows that we haven't watched or even heard of yeah and i was like oh no is that another show i gotta get into right exactly <laughs> maybe <laughs> but, where did this one come but from the premise seemed cool like they're making them do like some like uh little games and stuff like that like match and, yeah, for right more like compatibility thing yeah and then they got they're like letting other people match people up for dates and all that stuff i was like that might be kind of cool yeah hopefully it will be yeah all right everybody well there you have it uh that's love and blind Se- love and blind love, <laughs> love, and blind. love is blind season three uh down right hopefully that's it maybe we might get another episode later on i don't, I don't need know. one yeah i really no. don't yeah i'm kind of ready to move on <laughs> yeah. I'm, they, the, the first episode was kind of interesting the second one with uh cole and brennan but it fell off after that Yeah, exactly. They're, even they're, the wrap up with sk and uh raven seemed kind of i am rooting for yeah, raven i'd so love to hear more about raven <laughs> yeah i feel so bad for her man but yeah but we're definitely looking forward to some perfect match, and we'll be uh, checking that show Make out. Make sure you subscribe, turn on the noties. Exactly, and talk to us about it. Let us know what you think. <laughs> Bye, folks. Hey, we love doing this for you. Please hit us up. Let us know what you thought about these episodes, and uh, until next time, we will check you guys later. See you guys. See ya. Well, that's like the T when they're like, oh, they want the T. And I was like, when, when the fuck did you know the 411 become the T? You know, the tea. Like, the yeah. tea. You spill yeah, the T. Yeah, you spill the T. Why is there a dentist? What's the T stand for? The information. They wanted the to know tea. the beats. You know, you they want the beats. The they want the T. Huh? In, the, in the show, when they were like, oh, we want to hear the T. You know, they want the T. It's not the letter. It's the it's spilling the tea. Spill the tea. Right, give us the details. You know, Who spills tea and drinks tea? Yes. Yeah, right, yeah. Right. Get the hell out of here. You're so that, old. Is that a British you thing? Are so old. No one it's wants tea, tea, man. Let's yeah, move no, on yeah, to the yeah, next thing right. that actually is cool. Right. Let's get some real shit. We don't need tea. <laughs> yeah, let's not get off on it, though. Are the people... <laughs> 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 yeah.